Following the BMW X5 facelift is the more interesting facelift, the 2024 BMW X5 M competition. The BMW X5 M standard is finished, toast, and gone for 2024. Only the BMW X5 competition survives, and it now boasts an all-new engine, new technology, and slightly snazzier new threads thanks to its little LCI facelift. The 2024 BMW X5 M competition now sports redesigned headlights, a kidney grille, tail lights, and bumpers, which affects how it appears. Instead of the standard X5 grilles, the new X6M inspired grilles have widely spread horizontal slates instead of vertical ones, a design cue from the M3 and M4. The new muscular front bumpers combine body color and black air intakes to form an intriguing zigzag motif on either side of the grille. Although strange, it's kind of cool. The traditional M design elements are still present, though. For instance, the quad exhausts still feel comfortable, and the mirrors still have a BMW M look to them. Brooklyn Grey Metallic, Isle of Man Green Metallic, and Frozen Pure Grey Metallic are now available as paint choices for the new BMW X5 M competition. Customers will also have access to about 50 different BMW individual paint colors. They consist of frozen finishes as well as metallic and non-metallic ones. Nonetheless, the interior has been considerably remodeled. While the cabin's overall form is mostly unchanged, several new design elements, including the redesigned curved screen and trim, have been added. The new screen is a dual curved screen that runs iDrive 8, and is the same as every other new BMW. The interior of the X5M was excellent prior to the facelift, and it remains excellent. Because of its new climate controls, which are solely integrated into the touchscreen, some fans may rue the addition of iDrive 8. Nonetheless, iDrive 8 is a huge improvement in terms of usefulness, and its screen looks substantially nicer than before. Also, compared to the previous model, the new M-style digital dials are considerably better. The BMW X5 M facelift's 4.4-liter twin-turbocharged V8 engine may provide the same 617 horsepower and 553 pounds to foot of torque as the previous X5 M competition, but fear not, everything is brand new for 2024. The updated X5 M employs BMW's new S68 engine, which is a vast improvement over the outgoing S63. It has a moderate hybrid 48-volt system, can produce greater power, and produces fewer emissions. BMW simply tuned it to have the same advertised power output as the previous generation model, however this was done on purpose and is not a fault with the engine. The BMW X5 M claims to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds thanks to the engine's combination with the same 8-speed ZF automatic transmission, and X-Drive all-wheel drive system. That's the same as before, and it's completely arbitrary as well because BMWs are constantly faster than their advertised speeds. The revised 8-speed M Steptronic gearbox benefits from higher gear ratios and a crisper shift action in addition to the electric motor that has been added for the 48 volts mild hybrid system. To make the X5 M more precise, BMW also made a few modest changes to the steering and chassis. For example, to make the X5 M the best handling version yet, new steering gear for the Servotronic variable steering rack, altered tone values at the rear axle, additional stiffness in the back of the car, and redesigned electronically controlled dampers have all been included. The X5 M before the LCI was already a really outstanding vehicle, thus these upgrades would only make it better. Manufacturing begins in Spartanburg, South Carolina, in April 2023. The starting price on the American market is $123,295, after destination. Although this is only a slight facelift, it is to be expected. The new engine and technology are what matter. The BMW X5 M may have the same performance and power numbers on paper, but since the Germans are known for underestimating their power, anticipated to be slightly more potent in practice. 
Its cabin technology also makes a significant difference in how we interact with our cars on a daily basis. So depending on how you look at its climate controls, having iDrive 8 is both a benefit and a drawback. Otherwise, it remains the same gorgeous, incredibly quick performance SUV.